Hey guys, my name is Akmal. So I would like to do this first video of 2020 officially. To make first, happy new year. Uh, health, wealth, prosperity to everyone uh, that looking for changes in life uh, that actually have kind of didn't happen in 2019. They want to do it in 2020. I wish all of you to accomplish your goals, your dreams, uh, as everyone wanted to do. So mine was particularly a couple of things that I realized them uh, last year. And a few more I wanted to do this year. So definitely that's already achieved because I do every year a list. So that list, it's very important to do since uh, I was around... Uh, I remember correctly, I was 17, around 17, 18, that I wished something that I want to accomplish, and it did happen, which I remember I even draw specifically something uh, like, uh, I remember uh, I want to actually succeed in my exam to travel and then uh, go to Montreal, let's say, uh, was supposed to be the next year after that. So I draw the picture, actually I draw the exact, um, the exact uh, plane, <laughs> even the, the, the logo and everything, like very, like it was, I don't even, I didn't even care the detail, but I draw it. I was like, okay, I believe it, it will happen. So, and then, uh, yeah, it happened. And I was like, the crazy part it was exactly the plane I took to come in Montreal and I still remember that day I was like holy shit so a couple of things happened after that that kind of did that again so and then and then I was watching a few things like movie like The Secret I'm sure everyone uh, a few people know about the that movie documentary about things like you write it down specifically you write it like want to accomplish something in particular like you believe it you feel it and it happens so that was kind of uh, those things that happened to me when i started doing it and then um was another one uh that one that struck me like crazy i'm a big fan of batman since a kid and when i actually um i wrote it specifically um i want to see the batmobile i was like Okay, I'll do something crazy. I'll, I photoshopped myself. I put the picture of the Batmobile and I put it exactly um, my face in it at my place in Comoros. Yeah, and I put it on Facebook. I remember people were laughing like, yeah, that's, we know it's not real and everything. And I was like, okay. So, and one year later, I swear to God, I saw the real thing in Montreal. I got that picture of both of them. <laughs> that was the. That's when I started. I was like, "Holy shit! It's it's really working, man." What if I do this instead? Of, that was another thing that was I want to accomplish. I was like, and then there was a. Uh, at some point, because my dream also was to work in movies like those. Since I'm a kid, I was like I was more impressed by. Uh, visual effects or superhero movies uh, back in the day spider-man one was my di my gig and then um so yeah i started doing it like what if it happens for real and i work on those kind of movies and so i did again write it down that part like i want to work one day on movies like spider-man batman any hero superhero i love like since i was a kid so i I write it down again and I put on my wall, especially like things are start to come, uh, like the place I need to go, like the, 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 the at least the, 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 let's say the, the school I need to go to start learning how to do uh, visuals and opportunities came to me in between. So, and people actually, I was meeting people as well. And then slowly, slowly was coming to me. I was like, holy shit, it's really working too. And then um, I remember my first, first job. Uh, when I got my first job, actually, I, it was hard to get in. So what I did was 
there was openings like they call it like uh, to visit the place so and I decided I will go in every single opening even I went once or twice I go until I get there so that's how I was creating that desire that I wanted to get there somehow because that's where I want to actually accomplish uh, my dream and then um, so I went like four or five times even some people recognize me you weren't there last uh, whatever month <laughs> well yeah it was me yeah yeah because I want to come here someday so I was like so passionate I wanted to go there I was like fuck it I'll do whatever it takes because I applied to that place like five or six times they said no 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 you're not enough uh, skilled whatever I was like Damn, and at some point I even felt like it was enough for me, but deep down I was like, fuck it, I'm still gonna go, I st still believe I will get there. And I met someone, like randomly, and he wore the shirt, he wore the shirt of the place I wanted to go. And I was like, holy shit, it's really, it's, it didn't actually, like, it's not, it's not done yet, I mean, uh, I didn't met this guy for nothing, so I went to ask him questions like, "How, how do you work there? How was the place? I mean, you know, what I can I do to?" So he gave me some tips and stuff like, uh, "Yeah, you have to do this, work on this uh, software," and then uh, yeah, I did it exactly what he said because uh, I felt I was close to get to the job I wanted, and then. Um, for a couple of months, yeah, I was working on a job that I hated so much, and at the time and. Again, I even got fired. That that the the, the uh, actually the, the thing was like I couldn't stand there. Like I want to go on that job specifically. I was thinking that on um, every day, like almost like fuck it. I want I want to work there. I don't care. So and then it happened uh, after like oh actually after I got fired <laughs> because uh, there was uh, at some point I need to find a way to to get there and then. At some point, I was watching the movie uh, Pursuit of Happiness with a friend. Actually, was looking for a job as well at the same at some point with me, and then we watched that movie. Like it took two weeks, two weeks that we got a call uh, by the place where I, where I want to work because the guy I met uh, to give me as a reference also uh, for the job, he gave my name. Uh, and actually when I was working at the time uh, on my skills and thing so he gave my name on the place I wanted to work and then I got the call and then uh, holy shit it happened <laughs> I got my first job there and yeah that's where I start to believe like it, it really works like you you still have the conviction you're gonna get there no matter what it'll happen I mean I didn't care like the skill, I didn't have enough skill because I knew the people there, there were like so many talented people, uh, so yeah, I, was, I knew there was a competition, but I didn't care, I was like, fuck it, I'm still gonna go, and it happened, and what I said before about the lists, um, about writing down your things, or I put it the, whatever, the, the, even the name of the company because that's what I did I put the name of the company and the movie I want to work on it maybe even I put the poster of it uh, which specifically I can tell you now it was Batman v Superman and uh, and the logo of the oh, actually the name of the company was uh, called NPC back in the day and still is so I was there for uh, where I got it of course the job the day I was like crying and I can like a kid. I even called my the friend I was watching Pursuit of Happiness to tell him, yeah, I got the job and I know you gotta get it too. And then one week later he got his that was the insane part and then oh the shit, it's really working. So yeah, that's pretty much it. And and yeah, so I got the job. I, the first day we got excited and uh yeah, it was a tough one, I'm sure that when I got because there was some things I couldn't, uh, well, I didn't have the, the knowledge, but I took my time to learn what I was working. So it was a great experience. And then, yeah, so basically I don't want to 
very much details about the job what I but the 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 specific thing was just the fact that it worked you know that's the one uh, one thing like I still make those things like clear on everything you set up to do you have to write it down you have to find a way to put pictures on it you know, I don't care but whatever like you feel you're in there already right so then uh and keep going keep going because i'm still doing that thing and then uh what i accomplished until now is is the proof like uh, i did that um like after like what 15 years i'm doing this <laughs> so now i can make a crazier things like uh, of course uh, some things you have to not tell too much because uh, there is a book of course a lot of people knows think and grow rich that said specifically to not tell more details you just have more like to listen than speak but there also of course the movie the secret i'm sure people know about that movie and that movie that's where the door were opening for me like was watching the the oh i'm almost like Every year I have to watch that movie, or at least every one, one, once a month I have to watch that movie because it's it's a it's a repetition. You have to repeat that process every day to make sure like sorry it's still working. So so yeah, so that's uh, was my first video about uh, writing your goals, writing um, what you want, what you desire. So. I'll make more of this for sure because um, that's something I, that people that helps a lot of people when um, they they know people that did something even crazier like they thinking like they could do it but they can as long as they believe so so that's pretty much it so have a nice one and once again happy new year 2020 have make 2020 your best year by having that message from me and my name again is akmal so that was my first video about the law of attraction uh, so i'll do more of this because that was improvised i didn't even write it down that thing i was just doing improvised video about my experience about what i'm thinking so so that's pretty much it so have a nice one happy new year Bye bye